What's up guys, my name is TechNobber here for Troubleshoot and today I've got a video for you on fixing a black screen if you're screen sharing or sharing an application in Discord or even streaming as you may call it. Basically, when you're inside of Discord, in a channel you're able to go live by clicking this button in the bottom left, then you're able to either pick an application or share your entire screen at once. Though sometimes when people are watching the stream, it turns out that the stream is actually black, they're not able to see anything, and sometimes they won't be able to hear anything. How exactly do we fix this? Well, usually if things are working properly, or have worked properly in the past, then a simple restart of your PC will be more than enough. Otherwise, if simply restarting Discord and or your PC hasn't helped, then there's a couple of fixes that we can get into that'll hopefully work for you. So, the first fix is probably the most obvious and a lot of you are already doing this, and that is to run Discord as administrator. Simply right click on your Discord on the bottom right and click quit Discord. Then once it's closed, we'll either search for Discord in our start bar or find the shortcut on our desktop. Then right click on Discord and click run as administrator. When prompted for admin, just click yes and then Discord should start up as per normal. Then try going live and see if anything has improved. Otherwise, we'll go ahead and continue with the next step. So the second step is to disable their quote unquote latest technology. Sometimes this will help, sometimes it won't. If it works for you, great. Otherwise, if you toggle it off, I'd recommend toggling it back on. Either way, head into user settings in the bottom left and then across to voice and video. Then scroll down a little bit over here until you find this all the way down at the bottom. Use our latest technology to capture your screen. Simply turn that off and try turning off using an experimental method to capture audio from game. Once these two are off, you can simply close out a Discord, restart Discord the same way that we did before, right click quit, and see if the problem is fixed. Otherwise, if the problem is still persisting, you can either leave these off, or if it's fixed itself, see if turning them back on lets it work again. Either way, if that doesn't work, then I'd highly recommend starting up your games in either windowed or full screen borderless, as capture can sometimes be affected by that. And of course, if you're streaming a game and having issues, then streaming your actual screen itself can sometimes fix that issue, though sound does sometimes stop working with that, and I think sharing your screen stops sound sharing at all. Then the next fix that we can possibly try is heading back to user settings, followed by voice video, scrolling down a little bit, and finding this over here, H.264 Hardware Acceleration. Simply turn this off, and hopefully your streams should work a little bit better. You can also try disabling the open H.264 video codec up here, and seeing if that makes a difference for you. Either way, if you're still having issues, then there's a few more things that we can try. Number one, try and update your NVIDIA or AMD graphics drivers and see if that helps you. Hopefully that should, Otherwise, there's probably a few last fixes that we can try. The first one is to go ahead and clear Discord's cache. To do that, simply close out of Discord entirely, hold start and press R, and you'll see this window over here pop up. Type in percentage, app data, percentage, and hit enter. Then we'll head into the Discord folder, and we'll see all of these things inside of it. Simply just control A to select everything, right click, and delete. If your Discord is open, it'll clear most of the files here, otherwise it'll run into errors like this, where you can go ahead and skip them. It may help, but of course having Discord completely closed would be preferable. And of course, the final solution, if that didn't work, is going ahead, uninstalling Discord entirely, and reinstalling it from scratch. Hopefully that should work. Either way, thank you all for watching. Hopefully this quick video helped you out. If you're still having issues, make sure to leave a comment down below and see if someone else is having similar issues. Anyways, my name's been Technoba here for Troubleshoot. Thank you for watching this video and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.